In this video, we'll look at how to configure a Dactronix cash credit display using the FLR3 100 or 400 control method. Configuration options include the three different states, cash, credit, or debit, the hold time, and changing prices. Dactronix standard cash credit displays are capable of showing multiple states of fuel prices that depend on the payment method. These states include cash, credit, and debit. To configure which states will display, hold down the minus sign on line 2 and the plus sign on line 4 simultaneously until the decimal on the display begins to flash. Next, use the buttons on line 1 to scroll through the different options. Cash is state 1, credit is state 2, and debit is state 3. You can select to show any combination or all of the three states. Once the desired configuration is selected, hold down the minus sign on line 2 and the plus sign on line 4 to exit the mode. The hold time for the cash credit debit states is also configurable. This is a global setting and applies to all of the states selected to display. The default hold time from the factory is 5 seconds but can be configured from 1 second to 9.9 .9 seconds. To set the hold time, hold down the minus sign on line 3 and the plus sign on line 4 simultaneously until the decimal on the display begins to flash. You will then see a number representing the current hold time. The first digit represents the number of seconds and the second digit represents tenths of a second. Use the buttons on line 1 of the handheld remote to adjust the desired hold time. To exit, simultaneously press and hold the minus sign on line 3 and the plus sign on line 4. To change the prices on your display, hold down any button on the FLR3 100 or 400 handheld remote until the decimal point begins to flash. Once in edit mode, the cash credit display will show the first configured state. Use the plus and minus buttons on the handheld remote to set the prices for the corresponding line. After all prices have been set for that state, wait for 10 seconds. The cash credit display will then change to the second configured state. Repeat the steps to set the prices for the corresponding lines. If using all three states on the cash credit display, repeat the process to set the prices for the third state. Once all prices have been set for all lines and all configured states, the display will exit edit mode 10 seconds after the last button press.